हेलो डियर फ्रेंड्स इन ट्रिक नंबर 210 वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न सम प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ साइक्लिक कोऑर्डिनेटर नाउ लेट अस फर्स्ट फर्स्ट अंडरस्टैंड व्हाट ए साइक्लिक कोऑर्डिनेटर इज सपोज वी हैव अ सर्कल ऑफ एनी रेडियस जस्ट टेक एनी फोर पॉइंट्स ए बी सी एंड डी anywhere on its circumference and join them in order say join a to b b to c c to d and d to a now this four sided figure whose all the four vertices they lie on the circumference of a circle this quadrilateral is known as a cyclic quadrilateral now there are some specific properties of a cyclic quadrilateral which are very important for all competitive exams questions are asked based on those properties and a knowledge of these properties will enable you to solve a lot of problems concerned to this important concept of geometry the first property of a cyclic quadrilateral uh, is that the opposite angles that is angle a and the opposite angle that is angle c the sum of opposite angles is always 180 degree so if you measure these two angles and add them up you will get the sum as 180 degree irrespective of where you have taken these four points on the circumference so if the quadrilateral is a cyclic quadrilateral its opposite angles are always supplementary that is their sum is always 180 degree so in this case angle a plus angle c they will add up to 180 degree and similarly the other pair of opposite angles angle d and angle b they will also add up to 180 degree very important property for students of class 9th class 10th who are learning this important concept for the first time and all classes beyond that because many questions are framed on this important concept so after this first important property let us look into another important property of this cyclic quadrilateral now i'm drawing another cyclic quadrilateral you say p q r s now this is a cyclic quadrilateral p q r s so all the four vertices lie on the circle now if you produce any one side of this cyclic quadrilateral suppose i produce this side p s so i have produced one of the sides of the cyclic quadrilateral so one exterior angle is formed now this angle one is the exterior angle made by producing one side to a point p so this exterior angle of the cyclic quadrilateral will always be equal to interior opposite angle now see this angle is adjacent to this angle one the exterior angle so opposite angle is this one angle q so exterior angle is always equal to interior opposite angle so in this figure angle 1 will be equal to angle q now suppose we have produced any other side also in this case suppose i am producing the side qp so qp gets produced to a point m so another exterior angle is formed now see this is the exterior angle angle 2 so this exterior angle has this angle adjacent to it so the opposite angle will be angle r so angle 
will be equal to angle r likewise you can make two more extreme angles by producing different sides and the same property will apply to those exterior angles also the final property concerning cyclic quadrilaterals is popularly known as ptolemy's theorem now ptolemy's theorem states an important property of cyclic quadrilateral in which first of all we have to consider the diagonals now in this figure these points a b c d they lie on the circumference so this is a cyclic quadrilateral now i need to draw the two diagonals of this cyclic quadrilateral now obviously the diagonals are ac and bd so one is the a, diagonal ac and another is the diagonal bd now what i do is i take the product of these two diagonals ac multiplied by bd now the product of these two diagonals of a cyclic quadrilateral is always equal to now you take the pair of opposite sides see one side is ab and the side opposite to ab is cd so ab and cd these are multiplied and take the other pair of opposite sides bc and da bc and da they are multiplied and just add the two products you will get the product of diagonals so product of diagonals is always equal to sum of now this it is sum of two things sum of products of opposite sides remember all these three properties are particularly applicable to cyclic quadrilaterals only for a normal quadrilateral the sum of opposite angles will not be 180 degree in a cyclic quadrilateral the exterior angle will always be equal to the interior opposite angle and the ptolemy's theorem in which you have the product of diagonals equal to sum of product of the each pair of opposite sides so these are three important properties a number of questions are asked concerning these important properties so you need to learn them need to practice them this series of videos on geometry will be highlighting some more important properties related to congruent triangles similar triangles so keep watching the channel share and subscribe the videos if you like it